Space Explorers between the lines in three, two, one, go. The Sandstorm rolls in here in Einstein match number 11. Team number 4003 for the Red Alliance starts out diagonally. They roll forward and place a hatch panel on the very bottom level of the Red Alliance rocket. Now going for another, and they will deliver just seconds into teleoperated control, helping them push out in front early. The Daily Alliance going up on Carson, now under full driver control. Team number 862 going on the defensive early in this match. They're gonna try and slow down team number 5050 of the Blue Alliance, Cowtown Robotics from Carleton, Michigan. They're lined up at the far side, Blue Alliance Rocket. They make a delivery, and with the delivery of that hatch panel, opening up that bottom level to be able to score cargo within. And now 5050 with a cargo in tow will deliver. 2052 and 133, the pushing match on the far side of Primus. Nightcrawler is the blue team in enemy territory here, playing a two-on-one match between 133 and their alliance partners, Trisonics. Despite that interference, Trisonics does deliver and heads back for another piece of cargo. Plenty of scoring positions here for Trisonics as level one of the rocket and the cargo ship both with open bays. 70 seconds remain in match number 11. Red with a slight advantage, 45 to 42. Still plenty of spaces left in the cargo ship. All patched up with null hatch panels here. A quick hit from Nightcrawler, but Bert able to deliver in time. Now the matchup between Wildstang on the near side of the field with Lightning Robotics. The tie-dye machine is able to deliver on level one of the rocket as they will have to head back and recollect another hatch panel and install it for any more scores there on the near side of the field. We have 35 seconds left in the match. Two points separating these two alliances. Daily currently with the advantage as 4003 makes another delivery into the cargo ship, bringing that total up to a seven, and we enter our end game period. Two blue machines back to collect, running simultaneously now as 862 trying to slow down the blue machines heading into the hab zone. 133 and 4003 lined up next to each other in the red habitat area. Bert is up and ready to go. 4003 is as well. Red with the advantage here as time runs out. Unofficially, red with the win, but we will get your official scores from the referee. Red Alliance, the score was 83 to 82, ladies and gentlemen. Daily taking the one point game here on Mass. Round Robin match number 12 here on the energy field.